Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a case of 2021 Topps Tier 1 Baseball. 12 box, pick your team, number 5 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. No fillers or anything, we just knocked this out straight up, which I always appreciate. So thanks for spending a bit of your Thursday night with us and thanks for uh, getting into the action. Big thanks to Jeremy for grabbing the last couple teams there. That's why he's the last spot mojo star next to his name. Some people say, as legend has it, Last Spot Mojo, 60% of the time, hits 100% uh, hits of the time. According to legend. Jaspi legend. with too many hits. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There you go. There we go. Here we go. Go, go, go. So let's get a blank card right here. And I think the relics are on the bottom and the autographs on top. So let's get the bottom one first. There's Hyunjin Ru, 92 out of 299. Piece of his jersey going to Jason and the Bluebirds. Nice, on the board already, Jason N. Did he, did he make a start today? I think he did. Looks like he has a he had a pretty decent start. I think he got the win. Former Dodger Hyunjin Ru. He went five innings, scattered six hits, four earned runs, six strikeouts, and a walk. That's not bad. Not a bad day. He can do better, but not a bad day. All right, next relic is Andrew McCutcheon. Piece of his lumber, seventy nine out of two ninety nine. That's for the fighting Phils. That'll be for Derek Hamilton for the Phillies. And the autograph is Casey Mize. Nice. 68 out of 300. Got a good start. Last time out. I don't know if this is going to go into a 55. Let's have to go into a 130. Oh boy, top loader shortage, ladies and gentlemen, still happening. We've just been every week. We're just scrambling to get top loaders here and there. So we're gonna have to put these really thin cards that should be in like a 75 point top loader. We have, we're having to put them in a 130 top loader. We're using an extra wide penny sleeve though, so maybe that'll help it from rattling around. Our shipping team will also put blue painters tape right here to keep it from rattling around during shipping. But in case it's not there, or in case you're you're removing the tape and putting into a different top loader, just be careful. Just be careful and make sure it doesn't slide out on you. Uh, Jeremy with the Tigers. I've got Casey Mize on my fantasy team and starting to slowly starting to put some, uh, some decent starts together. Be good for the hobby, former number one overall pick. All right, down here we've got Carlos Correa to 299. Astros, that'll be for Martin. We got the Nets in Dallas. A little basketball on the background. My Lakers coming up next. We got Ryan Jeffers, 155 out of 300 for the Twins. That'll be for Raymond. And another autograph. Joey Votto, nice. Now it's kind of hard to see here, but if you look carefully, 
there's a there's the Reds logo kind of printed in the background. Sort of hard to see. But the, those shadows right there are actually the Reds logo. It's actually a cool look. I'm sure this looks awesome in person. Four out of, for you, for me, it already looks awesome. Four out of 10. Reds, Jeremy Razor with that. All right, next one. Mavericks up by five with only 6.7 seconds left. Andres Jimenez, 16 out of 399, piece of his lumber for the tribe. That'll be for Roger. He was involved in the, uh, the Francisco Lindor trade. We got Starling Marte to 300, Miami Marlins. It'll be for Donald and the fish. We've got Ryan Mountcastle, 22 out of 25. Gold ink autograph for the O's. Jeremy Razor, last spot mojo, strikes again. struggling big time. Francisco Lindor went one for three. A few walks, too. We got a lot of, lot of at-bats. There you go. All right. Looks like there's a redemption in the middle. Any guesses on the redemption? 242 out of 299, Jim Tomey. We got Rafael Devers, 169 out of 200. Red Sox, Jonathan Kent. All right, the redemption is gonna be, it's gonna be Hassan Kim for the Padres. Middle infielder for the Friars, that's gonna go to It's going to go to McSub. And time expires. Mavs beat the Nets 113 to 109. It was a pretty good game. Mike Trout, 002 out of 199. Benjamin with the Halos. There are two autographs here. Uh, poor Elo Jimenez. I think he tore that tendon in his pectoral muscle that attaches to the shoulder. I think the one like right at your armpit. Oof. And then his teammate Luis Robert with a hip flexor tear. There you go. That'll go to the White Sox. John, they should be fine, but kind of a bummer. I feel like they were going to be – it was going to be fun to see that next sort of level of those youngsters, see where they go. There's Jake Cronenworth. He's pretty good too, to 300. Martin with the Padres.
Uh, Luisa Reyes at three ninety nine. Raymond with the Twins. There's Ian Anderson for the Bravos, 23 out of 25. Howard with the ATL. And then we got Jorge Soler, 50 out of 300 for KC. Jeremy with the Royals. Casey Mize again to two ninety nine. Casey Mize, Spencer Torkelson, Riley Green. There's some a lot of. I mean, unfortunately, the Tigers have not been very good, so they've been able to get some good talent. That could all start to come together. We got William Contreras. For the Braves, I think he had a home run the other night. 114 out of 300. That's Wilson Contreras' brother. Both catchers. Let's see if that's going to be hashtag good for the hobby. Keep an eye on him in the season. Starling Marte. Another one for the Marlins. Second one for Donald. Next box. Is this a three auto box? All the cards are thin. It might be. There's Kyle Hendricks, 110 out of 300 for the Cubbies. Maybe for Jonathan Arnaldi. We got Luis Garcia, 008 out of 300. Nationals, Gregory with the Nats. And Reese Hoskins, nice triple auto box, 144 out of 200. Reese Hoskins still has one of the nicest uh, autographs in the hobby, I think. Great penmanship there for Reese. And that'll be for Derek Hamilton and the Phillies. Boxes. Good luck. We got Corey Seager to 299. For Steven and the Dodgers. Dodgers struggling mightily last week or so, but we'll be back on track. We got John Crook for the Phillies. Crookie. Going to Derek and the Phillies. 146 out of 300 on this one. It's a cool shot of him right there, the bat. And we got Alex Kirloff, 007 out of 250 for the Twins. Raymond with that. Ad, that's true, mix up, you're right. It, it, Reese Hoskins' autograph is good, but not even the best on his team. Aaron Nola's autograph. Aaron Nola's autograph, definitely for sure. One of these days, if we have a free moment, mix up, we'll we'll have to we'll have to have a we have to have the all autograph team. We'll pick a pitcher, a catcher, first, second, third, short, and the and and three outfielders. Doesn't have to be left, right, or center, but three outfielders and a and a closer. Obviously, the closer would be Mariano Rivera. He has the best closer autograph in the hobby, I want to say. 
Another three auto box. But could Aaron Nola be the starting pitcher with the best autograph? Maybe. All right, we got Ronald Acuna Jr., 14 out of 70. The all autograph team. Braves, Howard with the Bravos. We got Eddie Alvarez to 300. I feel like maybe we should do a current one. We, we should do an all time one and then current player one. There's Eddie Alvarez for the fish, Marlins, Donald. And then Austin Meadows, 297 out of 300. Yeah, Eckersley did have a good autograph. Andre Doss, the Hawk, definitely has a great autograph. He'd, he'd take an outfield spot for sure. I think we'd have to do two separate ones, though. We would have to do an all-time one and an active player one. I guess an active player could be on the all-time one, but we have to do an all-time one, too. Right, right, right. Yeah, we'd have to do two mixed up. You're right. Because all the old school guys have better penmanship in general. <laughs> Retired player one, and then an active player one. All right, we got Tony Gwynn, Legends Relic, RIP Tony Gwynn, taken from us too soon to 199. That'll be for the Friars. That's going to be for Martin. <laughs> Jonathan's going to pick all Cubs. He's a Cubs guy. There's Kenta Maeda, Twins. That'll be for Raymond. And Evan White to 300. That'll be for Seattle. Kenneth with the Twins. Right, the old guys didn't have to sign as much. But I also think they probably texted less. Had to sign more things more often. Checks. Other documents. But mostly checks, I guess. You know, maybe they writing letters a little more often. Postcards. The kids these days just don't write in general. All right, last box. Good luck. We got Roberto Clemente, 23 at 25, dual relic. Two pieces of his lumber for the Buckos. That's going to be for TJ with a little piece of history here. Next two are Tanner Hawk, 92 out of 300 for Boston. Jonathan Kent. And last but not least is a Trevor Bauer autograph for the Reds. 34 out of 300. Jeremy Razor with the Cincinnati Red Legs. And there you have it, everybody. Another case of Tier 1 in the books. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.